New England under flood watch. Sunday in Orange County, New York, suburban roads turned to rushing rapids after nearly a foot of rain fell. A woman in her 30s was killed, swept away while trying to escape. Water surrounded a synagogue about 40 miles outside of New York City, coming right up to the windows. In this area, in this neighborhood, I think this is the first where the water actually came up uh, this much. In Norfolk, Connecticut, swollen waterways chewed through a bridge. Flooding closed a highway in Reading, Pennsylvania. All as the National Weather Service warned Monday about a considerable flood threat for much of New England, with special attention to Vermont and northeastern New York. The storms stalled flights at airports across the country, with thousands of delays and cancellations. I got rebooked on a different flight today, so I had to stay overnight. Um, but that flight is also canceled. Meanwhile, parts of the south and southwest are locked in a week's long heat wave with dangerously high temperatures. It's not uncommon within 30 minutes to be unconscious from the heat. Phoenix, Arizona is gearing up for an 11th straight day of temperatures above 110 degrees. Jared Hill, CBS News.